Most people would be bummed out, returning to shore empty-handed after hitting the waves. But not these guys. Down on southeast Oahu's sandy beach, the body surfers are out in the water competing in the 2012 Hawaii State Body Surfing Competition. One of the 8th TSC's own NCOs has entered and is ready to give it his all. Today we're entering uh, Sandy Beach Body Surfing Championship uh, in different age groups. I'm like in a fourth age group, uh, going up against some of the island's best that they have. So I'm looking forward to uh, competing against these guys. The sun was out, shimmering on the waves, which are gorgeous any time of year. And it was easy to feel the sense of community and see the appeal of the sport. Growing up in Hawaii, I actually, my dad used to take us to the beach a lot. And then I just took up body surfing and boogie boarding more than anything else. Because there's nowhere else really to body surf that I like to go. I just wish more and more uh, soldiers will go out and actually learn the sport while they're on this island. You know, you got three years to learn it and you can learn it within a year. You just got to be safe about it and go out with somebody who's experienced to teach you how to body surf or boogie board or surf, whichever event you feel like doing. If you'd like to know what water sports you can take advantage of while on island, a great resource is your local MWR. Reporting from Sandy Beach, I'm Sergeant Jesse Anzalon.